Hi, good morning, good day, wherever you are. This is our global webinar series, Real-Time Daily Train Ideas. We have five days a week, five different traders. We will speak about train ideas, strategies, market screening, maybe one or two questions from your side directly answered in our webinar. Our goal is every day is the same, quick and smart. So let's have a nice start like every day. And today it's Thursday, 17th of January 2019. Welcome to Admire Markets. We will start like every day with our risk disclaimer. Trading with financial instruments offered by Admiral Markets carries a high level of risk which is not suitable for all investors due to their complex nature. If you are a starter, please start with a demo account and make yourself familiar with long trading, short trading, leverage trading, and your personal risk management. If you'd like to read the full risk disclaimer, just visit one of our regional web pages, for example, admiralmarkets.com, and you will find the long version there. If you are in the European Union and you will still like to read and find out more about the topic of the year 2018 and maybe still to 2019, the different offers and options and regulation for retail clients and professional clients. Also, this is to find online on our web pages. Sometimes a picture shows more than 1,000 words. Here we even have two pictures, DAX 30 and Euro Dollar. The margin requirements examples between retail clients and professional clients could be quite different. If you're a professional trader and you like to get the professional client status, if you are eligible, you can apply for that online. Retail clients still have a big benefit. It's called unlimited protection against negative balances by regulation. Professional clients don't get that via regulation, but some brokers and of course all the other markets offer something additional. It's called negative balance protection policy. Via that policy, you are protected even as professional clients up to 50,000 British pounds. What is around about 70,000 euro? Check it out with all details on our webpage and you can apply for it if you like to get this status. This is me. My name is Jens. My English made in Germany, so I'm the German guy from Admiral Markets. We are a big international forex and CFD broker, but I'm not the main speaker. The main speaker is the day trader of today. This is our scheme on Monday at Jay's Day, on Tuesday at Sports Day, on Wednesday at Giancarlo's Day, like today on Thursday at Marcos Day, on Friday at DX Day, our leading day traders live every business day, every training day to the same time. And of course, if you like to trade forex and CFDs, many benefits waiting for you here at Admiral Markets. DAX 30, triple spread of just zero rate points. Two main trading hours, Euro dollar, zero dot six, triple spread without additional commission. Check it out on admiralmarkets.com, for example. A global webinar series, one world global office. If you like to check out what we are doing in Chile office, what we are doing in our European offices or in Australian office, yes, the choice is yours. Check it out. Also here we have a web page for you. Go online to admiralmarkets.com. Enough from my side. Now it's time for Markus, our day trader of today. Good morning. Good day. What's your view to the markets today? Good morning, Jens. Good morning, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a great pleasure for me to work with you in this Admiral Markets webinar. I hope you're doing good. Uh, have a great night wherever you are. And let's talk about the markets and some special ideas. Success, you know, is not a fantasy, it's a formula. This is our, that's the probabilities of around 72%. If you make trends, trends trading, if you make trades out coming from the accumulation phase, you know that's one of the tenets of the Dow theory. This is what we want to trade. That's the view we have to the markets. Our seven rules, trend, young trend, correction, out of the correction, waiting for the rebound, outside of the fair value zone, market profile, you know, trend and price is most important things in trading. Then Fibonacci and market profile help us to find the target and big picture should support us when we look at the market. And with this in our mind, let's talk about some special markets, DAX and so on. We want to start with the DAX. And this is a really interesting situation for our part-time traders. They make trades in the hourly chart. Then the daily chart is the leading trend and you should make sure that the big picture is support you by trend, by divergence or by great support or resist if you want to go short. So what do you see in daily chart in DAX? Of, uh, for example, you see especially the down the short trade or the short trend at the moment. But you can see there is built up a little bit more volume. Actually, point of control is placed at the moment, just a moment. The point of control is placed at the at around about 12,220 points in daily chart, of course. But you can see we built up a little bit more well volume here on around about 10,600 points, and we are above of this point of this great support here. 
maybe something sh uh, uh, but uh, something can happen the next days uh, you see movement a little bit a broken uh, up correction next movement and then maybe this volume zone here could be uh, the next uh, support and if the price will go back to this point to the support zone then we can think about a new long trade up to this point 12,000 and if you will see this situation then you can switch to the hourly, to the hourly chart and here you see we are at the moment in a short trade we are around the point of low in a green zone and maybe the price will go back more and lower into the deep in the green zone that's good for us cause the normal behavior of trade of trends or the normal behavior of price is always go back to the point of control to fair price and the fair price in the hourly chart is placed at around 11,319 points so in this situation when the price in daily chart goes back when the price in hourly chart goes back then we can think about a long trade but not yet you have to wait when the rules fits to that situation um, <clears throat> Then let's have a look at the S and P, uh, the Dow Jones. Sorry, the Dow Jones. You can see this is one of the evidence I told you all the whole time since we worked together. The price will go back into the fair price zone, and you saw we had a, a low at twenty thousand points, twenty thousand six hundred twenty points, and now we are at around about twenty four thousand points. And the price and the point of control is placed. At, at 24,777 points, and you see we are strong on the on the way on it. We are strong on track on the to the point of control. So, what can you do? Is it a situation for making trades? No, because we are in the move, and you know after every move, the next correction will come. So you have to wait. You can see this little trend: movement, correction, movement correction and if you will see a correction down to the point of low or very close to this special point and we will see a balance candle there then we can think about to the next uh, trend or the, to the next movement up to the point of control so in hourly chart in hourly chart you have to wait you see you are among the red zone and it's forbidden to make trades in the fair value zone cause like the name is called it's a fair price and there's no chance to make sense uh, useful trades in that way so have patient wait will the price came back will come back to the point of uh, low here in the hourly chart as well as in the daily chart and then we can think about how we can make our rules by this trade up to the next point of um, control so um, what is a balance candle? Of course, I will show you a balance candle. It's your webinar. Look at this one. A balance candle is this one. Um, balance candle, look at this one, has a small body, really small body, and shadows on the lower and upper side, uh, at least uh, double, uh, must be double larger than the, uh, than, the point, uh, than the body. You see, a small body and a large and a big shadow on the upper and lower side or this one you can see that's balance candles uh, that's a balance candle here you see small body small body and a, and a um, uh, shadow on the our lower and on the upper side and a balance candle give you the signal that the move is coming to an end or the correction is coming to an end the end and that's the reason why our one of our rules is called wait to the balance candle. Then the balance candle will show you the balance between suppliers and uh, buyers. The supply and demand comes to a balance and then it's a great signal Then the correction is finished and we can start the next movement like you can see here maybe in the DAX. But the correction has to um, finish at the point of flow then we can make a long term not among the red zone this is price trading and in combination with 
trend trading. Okay, let's switch to gold. And gold has uh, gold has nothing nothing changed. Uh, uh, gold nothing changed since last Wednesday, uh, last Thursday, of course. Uh, sorry. And you see, we are in a sideways phase. We are very far in the move, and but the correction uh, doesn't work at the moment. That means that we has a re that we have a really strong price of gold. And you see where we are. We are in the fair price zone. Can you see where's the price, where's the point of control place? Of course, $1,322 at the moment. Where we come from, where we come from? From the unfair value price zone. In trend direction, up to the point of control. Trading at itself, guys, is so easy. The real challenge is taking place on your mind. That's the reason why I am working with the rules. The only behavior, the only chance to survive in trading on a long-term distance is play base, your, your trading must be based on rules. Rules must be duplicable, consistible. That's the thing, that's the one thing you can survive in trading. So what you have to do in gold? Nothing. Nothing. That's one of our rules. In the daily chart, you need templates. Either you have a trend and you will come out of the correction. So the chance where here you can see it. Let me show you here. After the correction has stopped, or uh, after the correction stopped here at the point of low, then here was there was the balance candle. That was the signal to go up. So, but now we are in the move. Do you have a divergence? No, you have. No, you don't. Uh, do you have a great uh, resist? Or a support because we want to go long. No, you don't. So no chance for making trades in that price. So save your money and save your nerves and your uh, behavior. You must be calm in trading. Um, always, if you are very excited in trading, you have the wrong penguin factor. What does it mean when I say penguin factor? You know, a penguin is very displaced outside of water. But is a penguin inside of the water? He can play with his strength, and this is the same here in trading. You must be calm in trading, really calm. If you uh, if you have too much money in the market, you are too excited, and this ends in, of course, in actionism. And actionism is a very bad guide in trading, really bad guide. But this is another topic we have to talk in other webinars. So um, let's see uh, let's see oil, um, oil WTI, the lights, uh, sweet oil. And you see here, look at this one. This is one of the best evidence when I, when I tell you the price will always go back to the point of control. We had a high at $77. And you can see, whoops, whoops, down to the point of control, very, very strong. This is always the same behavior, guys. And this is why I'm telling you all the time, you have to learn trading. Do it together with Admiral Markets. We have a lot of webinars. You almost, I guess, uh, 15 webinars a week. You can learn it, but you need to learn it. It's a duty that you have to learn trading. Otherwise, you will fail on a long-term distance. Maybe you can be successful in the short term, but then it's, it's an accident, and you cannot uh, double, you cannot make double cap an accident. That's really really bad. So in oil we are in a downtrend. You can see it in the downtrend. We are in the correction at the moment, but you see we are among the red zone. The red zone means no trade possible there. So you have to wait when the price come back to the point of control. If you will see their stabilization, then we can think about a trade in the hourly chart. So, at the end, I want to show you, of course, as every week, an interesting trading chance. And I found something for you. Swiss Fraud Japanese Yen. Look at this one. We have this Chinese crash here about in the new year. And now we can see this stabilization here around let me paint for you if you can see it 
Look at this one. It has a great support zone at around 109, 109 uh, Japanese yen. And if the price will establish stabilization here, then we can think about a long trade in hourly chart. But only if we can see here this stabilization. You must be patient. But you can put it on your watch list, Japanese uh, Swiss phone, about the Japanese yen in hourly chart. So the signal, you know, one of the templates, trend divergence or great support. We want to go back to the point of control. And you can see here maybe this stabilization. So be patient now. Switch to the hourly chart. And here you can see, first of all, the best situation, we are down in a green zone. We are in an unfair valued zone. And we want to go up to the fair zone. The price will go back to the point of control at around 112 Japanese yen. But actually, we are in a downtrend. So you have to wait. If we have a down, a long trend, then our rules, you know, long trend, young trend, of course, then the correction, 38% at least, then the balance candle, and then you can go in your trade. Uh, that's the rules. So and it's easy to make real trading in rules. It makes you really calm um, when you have your rules and when, when you stick to your rules all the time, of course. So put it on your watch list, Swiss, uh, Swiss franc, Japanese uh, yen. The same procedure, almost the uh, same procedure in British pound to Japanese yen. You saw the big down at Chinese crash, of course, then we saw or we, uh, we can see here the stabilization at the point of low and now we are on the track on to the point of control here above of this currently price here right now. So this is the situation we can switch to the hourly chart because you need the support from the big picture. Don't forget it, please. So and now you can see, first of all, yes, we have we are price in. We have the price in the green zone, and uh, scroll out. Point of control, very far above of us, 144 Japanese yen. And now, here you can work with our rules. Look at this one. I will show you. And now you can see movement, correction, no trend. Movement, yet you have the trend. Now you have the trend, and now. You see the correction, your correction zone, your correction zone is placed from here to here. Now you can see your balance candle last hour, and now you can make your trade from here up to the point of control with a stop below this point three. This is a great trading chance you can make, and the target is placed at the point of control. And maybe you can put on the half of your position out from the markets at the point of low, make your trade safe with the trade with the stop on your entry, and then the rest let the market decide how much money you will get from the money. Don't cancel the trade at the point of low. Take out the half of your position and let the market decide how much money you will get with the rest of your position. So you see a great Great daily trading chance in Japanese yen, uh, in British pound to Japanese yen. So that was mine. You at the market. Thanks for listening to me. Thanks for your attention. I hope you learned something a little bit about my trading approach. Uh, otherwise, you can uh, switch to my homepage, dowhowmineistrading.com. Switch to the English version. Everything is available in English for you. And with this in our mind, be careful about your thoughts. They are the beginning of your actions. Back to Jens. Thanks. If you like that, tomorrow another day, same time, same place, but another day trader, five days a week, five different traders. So I hope to see you all tomorrow again. If you'd like to see and watch that again in a couple of hours, it will be available as a recorded video on our YouTube channel. Just go to youtube.com slash Greetings from London office. All the time, good trades. See you. Bye-bye.